Lucas Media. Don't forget to like button, subscribe, y'all. So Terrence Gangster Williams recently, or I say recently, as in today, gave his reaction to the whole Hassan Campbell situation. And hold on one moment, I'm gonna play a quick clip for y'all. Actually, go live in the hood. Dan show in the hospital. Y'all got shot, but I'm still alive. Man, it's like when he said that, y'all, it just remind me that he's still traumatized from Bambara. Now, was it Sunday? We yeah, believe it was Sunday. Hassan Campbell went on live and basically talking about, you know, y'all can support Cassie, but no nobody want to support me. And he's always alleged that African Bambada has did appropriate things with him when he was underage. So give me one moment. I'll play another part of it. Bam, 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 somebody bammed him. And he's still traumatized from that. Because that little kid came out of him. But the sad part about it is he have a big following and people watching this. Which is true. Hassan has over 400,000 plus people. And he's, I've at least known him for at least the last year and a half, two years. But yeah, he has a real huge following. Let me play another part. And you're doing this for attention. Come on, man. This way... And, and he famous for his lives. He famous for that. He want to be in there with 10,000 people, and he just running and raving. You know, his crew in there, the rainbow in there, and, and they in there having a good time. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and I understand. I see what you're doing. But to go this far? Go All right, I'm going to stop it right there. So let me add my thoughts. Check out Terrence uh, Gangsta Williams' channel. Look. I know I came in the other day and I talked about Hassan and I even gave a, a take as far as like the things we don't want to talk about in our community. But I, I do agree that Hassan should have never been there in the first place. I We get it. You was traumatized. And, you know, if that did happen to you, you didn't deserve it. But Hassan, you're at least, I would say, 46, 47, right? Get you some therapy, you know what I'm saying? And stop feeding into things, these people online, people that's trolling you, if it's not, not that's not say if it's not true, but why are you, why, why are you bothered by these people online? Stop paying attention to it. And then Terrence uh, Williams also goes on to say, you know, you got kids and stuff. And I, and he writes, son, you got kids you showing them online. You should be showing your home, your fish. Who cares about what somebody thinks back in the back in the projects of you? You winning. I seen him do an interview with Math Hoffa talking about he's made 40, 50, 60 grand in a month. So it, it shouldn't matter what nobody thinks online. You know, and everybody gets haters, right? If y'all make a channel, people going to critique y'all or make fun of y'all. and People be on here going at me. It's who cares if you're making 40, 50, 60 K a month. But if you're still hurt and and you feel like the world doesn't give you justice, man, you gonna have to go get you some some therapy. And we got to our brothers got to start doing that. There's nothing wrong with going to therapy. You know, a lot of us are traumatized by different things as, as a child, but. You are in a position to go get that and still get your message across. When you go to a neighborhood looking for trouble, trouble usually comes. Now, let's say you did get, let's say your TV got turned off, as you always say, permanently, right? It got unplugged, unplugged from the wall. Now what? Now your kids don't have a father. Your money stops grossing and you can no longer get that message out of what you want people to hear. See, you got a lot of people by just talking about the whole situation that you went through because believe it or not, Hassan, a lot of brothers went through that type of pain. So they're following you because of that. And the ones who didn't, they still understand because they have people that went through that. And even the people who make fun of you, they're, they're turning in because they see how consistent and dedicated and passionate that you are, but it's not worth you putting your life at risk for what? For what? You think I'm finna leave my mansion 
in New Jersey and go back to the Bronx to challenge to challenge you. No, I'm not doing that. For what? I've already won. You've already won, Hassan. You know, and I hope the brother hears this, man. Um get well soon. If get well soon, I've seen you posted you in the hospital, but it ain't worth it. It's not. And if you do go back to your old neighborhood, have some ha, have your team with you, man. Have some security, a team, somebody. But that's just my quick thoughts about it, man. Y'all check out uh, Terrence Williams' uh, podcast or his YouTube channel, whatever you want to call it. Make sure y'all check it out and tell me what y'all think about it.